So before I go to the phone calls, Amarosa is at it. And Amarosa is a black, godless, evil, nasty, I want to call her a human being, but that's too nice. <laughs> Just a person you can never trust. And this woman claimed to be a Christian, and she claimed to be a preacher. And at one point, she worked for the Great White Hope. He was nice enough to hire her there at the White House. Even after hiring her or firing her several times or a couple of times for sure, uh, on The Apprentice. And he gave this woman another chance, and she's just a horrible person. And supposedly she's writing a book uh, about the, her time at the White House, I guess. Am I right about that? It's released already. This is James. Yeah. And James is my producer and the host of The Hake Report, H-A-K-E. The Hake Report, Sunday mornings at 9 a.m. Pacific time, 9 a.m. Pacific time. Check him out. So she, the book is out. Yeah. And so, so she's doing all these media interviews about it. And I want you to notice that the liberal media is grabbing hold of her to use her in order to try and hurt the president. It's not going to happen. Emma Rosa would destroy her own life because no one is going to trust her after this. And even the liberals are going to get rid of her once they're done with her. She'll be kicked to the curb. Well, so she's out there bad-mouthing the president. And James is here to tell us some of the things that she's saying and the president's response to her. So according to People magazine, she claims in her book that Trump is in mental decline and forgets from one day to the next. And she says that he was distracted, irritable, and short. That's because she was in, he was in her presence, <laughs> in the presence of evil. And you're supposed to forget from one day to the next one. Why well, remember yesterday when it doesn't exist anymore? Yep. You know what I mean? A dummy. She's a dummy. <laughs> She's evil. And she also told, according to NBC, she told the Today Show that Trump used the N-word about blacks on The Apprentice. They always end up with that. <laughs> right. When all else fell, accused the white man of using the N-word. <laughs> I can't even picture Trump <laughs> using it. Trump, he doesn't need to use it. <laughs> Trump is in, in control of his life. Why would he need to use a word like that? He's not afraid to tell you anything. Right. So he doesn't need to use that word. Yeah. Um, so, according to CNBC, Trump has called this morning Omarosa a dog after she said that she would cooperate with special counsel Robert Mueller's Russia probe, she told that. So said, now she's going to cooperate with them. Mm -hmm. She's a dirty dog. Yeah. Bow, wow, 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 wow. What's your dog? What's your dog? Bow, wow, wow. <laughs> That's not the words. What are the words? <laughs> I'm not going to repeat you, them. You heard that song, yeah? Talking about, the right. Are you talking about bow, wow, wow, yippee, oh, yippee, yeah. yippee? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> talking about the dog in yeah. me. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> anyway, go ahead. I'm sorry. So I have some tweets from Trump. Trump tweeted this morning about Omarosa. He said, when you give a crazed, crying lowlife a break and give her a job at the White House, I guess it just didn't work out. Good work by General Kelly for quickly firing that dog. Dog. She is a dog. A dirty dog. Bow, wow, 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 wow. wow. What's your dog? What's your dog? <laughs> I'm sorry. Go ahead. I get carried away. You're butchering it. <laughs> I do have t some tweets from Trump from yesterday. Okay. Uh, he said, Wacky Omarosa, who got fired three times on The Apprentice. She never made it, never will. She begged me for a job, tears in her eyes. I said, okay. People in the White House hated her. She was vicious, but not smart. I would rarely see her, but heard really bad things. Nasty to people and would constantly miss meetings and work. When General Kelly came on board, he told me she was a loser and nothing but problems. But I told him to try working it out because she only said great things about me until she got fired. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Friday dog. She, uh, I met this woman years ago. I was in... Uh, either Washington, D.C. or New York doing an interview on another network, and she was there, too, to be interviewed. And she came over and told me that she agreed with what I was saying. Wow. But she's a dog. <laughs> Will she yeah. come on the show? Uh, she might, Would yeah. You, yeah, get the dog on the show. <laughs> okay. A nasty woman. And she's married. 
and well, an ordained minister. How would you like to be married to that one? I bet her husband is beta all the way. <laughs> yeah. I'll take your calls when I come back. Thank you, James. Mm -hmm.